हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस क्विक सॉल्यूशंस फॉर ऑल इंडिया आकाश टेस्ट सीरीज मेडिकल 2019 टेस्ट नंबर फोर कोर्ट सी एंड आई विल बी डीलिंग विद बॉटनी सेक्शन सो लेट्स प्रोसीड विद द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर 91 वन सेज विच वन इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू रूट इन मोनोकॉटिलेटनस प्लांट वी नो दैट इन मोनोकॉट वी हैव फाइबरस रूट सिस्टम ओके so in monocots fibrous root system is there fibrous roots arise from the base of the stem so the first option says in monocots presence of fibrous root system which arises from the base of the stem this is true in monocot plants roots never originate from radical this is true because the fibrous roots which are found in the monocots they arises from the base of the stem so this is true in banyan trees roots arise from the aerial parts of the plant this is true for the banyan tree that roots such as prop roots which arises from the aerial parts of the plant but banyan tree is the dicot banyan tree dicot hai so this statement is not related to monocotyledonous plant so this is incorrect option the primary root which is short lived is replaced by large number of roots this is true that the primary root in the fibrous root system is short lived and it is replaced by large number of roots so the incorrect option or the statement which is not related to roots in monocotyledonous plants is option number 3 so answer to this question is option number 3 moving on to the next question that is question number 92 question number 92 says the region of the root consisting of very small thin wall cells with dense protoplasm we all know that humne classes mein padha hai ki aisa region jisme small thin wall cells with dense cytoplasm hai that region is called as region of meristematic activity now suppose this is the root okay this is the root cap okay root cap is just upper there is a region of meristematic activity then above it there is region of elongation and uske upar there is the region of maturation yahan se root originate hui hai radical hai yahan par this portion se root originate hoti hai that region ab us region ke bilkul pass jo ye this is suppose the origin yahan se root originate hui hai तो इस रीजन के पास वाले रीजन इज प्रोक्सिमल एंड दिस इज डिस्टेंट सो एज यू आर गोइंग अवे फ्रॉम द ओरिजिन द रीजन ऑफ द रूट इज टर्म एज डिस्टल विद रिस्पेक्ट टू द ओरिजिन द रीजन ऑफ द रूट कंसिस्टिंग ऑफ वेरी स्मॉल थिन वर्ल्ड सेल्स विद डेंस साइट ऑफ प्लाजम दैट इज द रीजन ऑफ मेरिस्टमैटिक एक्टिविटी लाइज प्रोक्सिमल टू द इलांगेशन जोन no region of meristematic activity elongation ke distal end par hai aur region of meristematic activity lies distal to the elongation zone if meristematic activity is lying away from the origin so it is distal to the elongation zone region of elongation is distal to the maturation zone and region of maturation is proximal to the elongation zone are you getting region of elongation is proximal to meristematic activity but 
region of meristematic activity is distal to elongation zone and region of elongation is distal to maturation zone okay second is region of meristematic activity has repeatedly dividing cells intermingled with differentiated cells it has repeatedly dividing cells this is true but those cells are not intermingled with differentiated cells so this statement is incorrect region of meristematic activity is situated slightly above the root cap it is situated slightly above the root cap this is very true and the region of meristematic activity gives rise to lateral branches of endogenous origin this is incorrect because this is true for region of maturation okay so the correct option is option number 3 Moving on to the next question that is question number 93 Which of the following is not correctly matched Datura is a radial symmetric flower true datura ka flower is actinomorphic The flower of delonyx is bilateral symmetric that means it is zygomorphic This is true Delonyx flower is zygomorphic. Trifolium. Trifolium is the member of family Fabaceae, and we know that the flowers of Fabaceae family are not trimerous. They are instead pentamerous. What are pentamerous flower? Pentamerous flower are those flowers in which number of sepals and petals are present. in multiples of 5 okay so in fabaceae family that means in trifolium the flower is pentamerous and not trimerous so this is the mismatched pair asymmetric flower in canna in canna we have asymmetric flower this is true so the mismatched option is option number 3 so answer to this question is option number 3 moving on to the next question that is question number 94 Question number ninety four says, plant of arid regions that modifies its stem into flattened structure that contains chlorophyll and carries out photosynthesis is. We know that this is phylloclade. Okay, now phylloclade is found in both Euphorbia and Aponia. So most of you must have marked the option all except three, because Morgan William A we have thorns. so this option is ruled out but c the plant of arid regions that modifies its stem into flattened structure flattened structure is found in aponia whereas in euphorbia it is cylindrical cylindrical structure is there so that means option number 1 is ruled out and the correct answer for this question is option number 2 okay moving on to the next question that is question number 95 select the incorrect statement with respect to stem stem is the ascending part of the axis which develops from the plumule of an embryo this is very true stem arises from the plumule and root arises from the radicle of the embryo stem usually bears buds either at apex of the stem or in the axil of the leaves this is true stem always bear branches arranged in acropetal manner no these branches can be arranged in both acropetal as well as basipetal manner so this is incorrect option stem has its role in storage of food protection and vegetative propagation this is true so by this out of these four the incorrect statement with respect to stem is option number 3 okay i hope you are clear moving on to the next question that is question number 96